Two million high school teachers are looking forward to opening new electives, combating interest in the upcoming school year. Hi, I'm Lindsay Fisher and I teach AP World History and World History One here at McLean. And I'm Julia Braxton and I teach AP Government and USDA History. So, Combating Intolerance is a, an elective that we're hoping to offer next year, and it's going to be all about the study of um, groups of people who have been traditionally um, discriminated against, both past and present, and the really cool thing that we're excited about for this course is that it's going to be totally student-driven, so there's going to be a lot of flexibility, and you, as the students, will have the opportunity to choose what we learn. I personally am really excited to teach this course because one of my favorite parts about teaching AP government is having more controversial discussions and I feel like being able to have um, tough discussions where we really examine the problems that our society is kind of facing and how we deal with different groups who have been traditionally marginalized. I think that, that would be really fun to do. Um, I think it would be great for students to be able to share their experiences and I would love to be able to facilitate really fun community services projects um, where we can have some tangible um, results in the community here at our school in McLean and maybe the state and the country. I think it'd be really fun to teach a class that can do that. I really want to focus on media literacy and having students understand many points of view and also where to find the most valid and interesting information. So I'm also looking forward to the idea of this open curriculum and not having to go at a certain pace and have to check off certain boxes, but really just be able to dig into what students want to know and giving students a more broad global worldview. Another thing that's great is that you can also, if something really exciting or really interesting happens in the news, we can start talking about it right that day. We don't have to go, okay, but first we need to take our test on blah, blah, blah. No, we can just say, let's drop what we're doing. Let's get into something that's really important and powerful and meaningful at the moment. It's great to take this class if you are interested in a class with a little bit more flexibility. We're hoping to be able to go on field trips, watch movies, um, and you know, if maybe you want a class that's just a little bit um, less stressful, we do not plan on having tests or quizzes, so it's really discussion and project and maybe a like, reflection-based kind of course. Also, not a whole lot of homework. You'll be taking these things home because these are things you see every day and you'll be excited about learning about them. So you may be learning about the class outside of school, but we're not going to go, okay, read chapter 27 by tomorrow, kids. Bye. Go ahead. Go ahead. This course is open to any students who would be interested and excited about learning about the modern world and things that really impact them. We're not looking for students who always take APs or students who don't take APs. We're looking for a really broad spectrum of kids to really make this an exciting and interesting class. And you will be able to register for this course if you are going to be in 10th, 11th, or 12th grade next year. There is not really any course that's like it at McLean. You would be the inaugural um, Combating Intolerance class if you were to take this. It looks really good on a college resume because of the kind of projects and the kind of community work that we'll be doing. And so one of the many reasons we're really excited. Um, so we encourage you, if this seems like something that's interesting, go ahead, sign up for it. Reporting for WMHS News, this is Frankie D. Warfare.